So today I'm going to be doing a video about 10 weird facts that you guys don't know about me. Coming up with this list wasn't even hard at all. The hard part was narrowing it down to 10. So first of all, if you're not subscribed to my channel, subscribe right now. Because you're going to love me. I promise you. Like, what's there not to love? You know what I mean? So anyway. Oh yeah, and if you're new to this channel, I'm obsessed with the color yellow. That's like my thing. Everything I own is yellow. Anyway, so number one weird fact about me is that I stress eat. Like, once I am stressed out, the next thing I comes to my mind to do is eat food. And eat and eat. And, and like sometimes I'm not even hungry, right? I'm not hungry at all. But just because I'm stressed out, I want to eat everything. And it's not a good thing. It's really weird because I don't know many people that stress eat. People say, oh, I eat when I'm bored or I eat when... I don't know, but I've never really seen anybody that stressed eats like when you're stressed you eat. I'm the only one I know. Okay, I asked on my Instagram, I'm quite in about people said I do too, like I also stress eat. But I think it's so weird how much I do it. It's so weird. So do you stress eat? I don't know, is it just me? If you stress eat, please let me know in the comment section because like I need to know that I'm not alone. <laughs> so the next weird fact about me that you guys don't know is that I have a cheap tooth right here I know I know it, it, I don't know why I, I don't know if I think maybe I had an accident when I was younger or something but all my life right all my life I've had a cheap tooth but people always come from my dentist and I'm like are you blind <laughs> but anyway I always take compliments in good faith hoping that you know maybe nobody sees it but i do have a chipped tooth so okay. the third fact about me is without my glasses okay first of all my uh, my vision for the two eyes are different that's the weird fact actually and the part b of this weird fact is without my glasses i'm almost like okay i'm not almost blind it's not that bad but i can barely see so yeah that's the third fact third weird fact about me i think some of you already knew that i don't know Number four, I talk with a lisp. I know! I know some of you have noticed that some of you have said, Oh, but do you know you talk with a lisp? Yes, I know I talk with a lisp, okay? Don't start looking at my mouth, but I do talk with a lisp. And if you don't know what a lisp is, it's when you talk with your tongue. Like, I don't know. Like, if you were to be reading my lips, you probably wouldn't be able to know what I'm saying because my tongue is in the way. Like, I talk with my tongue in front of me, but I think... People never really notice because they get distracted by the rest of my face. Thank you, Jesus. But I do talk with a lisp and yeah, it's just it's just one of those things and that people don't know. Weird fact about me that you guys so number five weird fact about me is you guys don't judge me. But I love the smell of foam and when you just turn an air conditioner. I can smell that for the <laughs> for the rest of my life. So I've told like a couple of people and they're like just because I want to know if I'm alone or if the other people like me, right? And they're like, oh, foam? Who smells foam? Why would you even be smelling foam? I'm like, I don't know. New foam, not just random foam, new foam. That's, that's it for me. I just, I'm just upset. I just love the smell of new foam. And when you first turn the air conditioner on, call me weird, whatever. Number six weird fact about me is, I don't know if this is weird, but I don't function well in clicks. Every time I've tried to have a clique of friends, it never goes well. I just don't function well with cliques. I'm a one, I'm a one friend type of girl. <laughs> like, I, like right now, I have just a very small circle of friends. They're enough for me. I just the whole clique thing doesn't work well for me. Every single time in my life, I've tried to be in a clique. Nothing. It doesn't work for me. So I, I would say that a weird fact about me is that I don't function well in cliques because I'm a girl. And most of the times, girls are clicked up. So. I just don't function when it clicks. I don't know. There's always a fight, always something. I'm just, I can't be, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I just, I just don't function when it clicks. Do you function when it clicks? Let me know if it's just me. Please, if there's any fact that relates to you, let me know. Because I always feel like I'm so weird. Like, why, why am I like this? I don't know. I really don't. <laughs> I really don't know. Anyway, number eight or number seven. I can't, I don't know what number we're at, but I, I'm just going to say it's number eight. I'm just going to say number eight. So number eight weird fact about me is I drive with two legs. <laughs> and no, I don't drive a manual car, but I drive with two legs. Like, I just can't use one leg to control the brake and the accelerator. I just don't know how to do it. 
I don't know. I, th I, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. Every time, every time I'm driving with someone and they notice that I drive with two legs, they're like, eh? What are you doing? I'm like, I, th I don't know. Because maybe because I learned with an automatic, with a uh, manual car. So I'm looking at it like clutch, brake, and. But I don't know. I just, I learned how to drive with two legs. So yeah like my leg is always on the brake and the accelerator but it's not pressed on the brake or on the accelerator at the same time it's just always there just in case i need to and i've tried i've tried so many times to learn how to drive with one leg but it is not working out for your girl at all so yeah that's number eight weird fact about me number nine weird fact about me is i don't play any sports nothing and i don't know how to play any sports i, I can't run i can't I can't do anything. I can't do anything sports related. I can't do anything because you know, I can't do anything sports related. I don't play any sport. I can't. I can't run. I can't do javelin. I can't. I, I, nothing. Nothing at all. I can't do any sport. I'm just. I don't know why. I just. I don't know why. I never. I tried. I tried. I think I tried high jump at some point in my life, but it was not working out for me. I'm five to where am I jumping high to? Like. <laughs> <laughs> like when they said the bar is like above my head, so it's like I wasn't even five two then. Just year I was like four eight, four seven or something. I don't know. I just wasn't five two then. Tried to do high jump, such a failed, failed attempt. But I don't, I, I can't do any sports. That's long and short of what I'm saying. I can't. Um, I had won a medal though, like, but it was in threading the needle. <laughs> Yeah, that was when I was in SIS. If you went to SIS, mm, mm, shout out to you. I did this competition during the heat where you run with needle, with M thread, then your partner is at the end of the line. You run and you're gonna thread needle, pick needle and come and you run back. So let me tell you, I've never I've never appreciated my mother this much before because Right from when I was small, I've known how to like using my hands has never been an issue for me. I'm really good with using my hands. My mom taught me how to sew. That row before my mates even knew how to turn the needle, I was a boss at it already. So this race, I told my I remember going up to my house captain, I told him, I can do this race and I'll bring the I'll bring the medal for us. I can do this race. And he's like, but you can't run when you thread needle. I said, trust me, the time it takes other people to thread a needle, I can do it. And like I told I believed in myself, so I was like, this one. I got this. I can do it. And then he was like, but you can't run. Well, I'm just just give this one a break, you know. You do queen for the house. You do princess for for the house. Or you match in front. You know, they always trying to use it because I'm me. Hello. <laughs> I'm just joking. But anyway, so I, I I assured him. I told him, you know what? I can do because there was one. You're supposed to have two people per house. And there was only one person and i told him let me be the second person and you guys i legit was the first person in the race and when they finished he carried me i remember his name very clearly mr asumi i don't even know where he is now in life but like i remember when the race was over he carried me and i turned around i said you said you can do it and you did it i said yes yes i still have that medal to today because it still means a lot to me first and only medal i ever won with an event related to sports thanks for coming to my TED talk that was a long TED talk but thanks for coming <laughs> so the number 10 weird fact about me is that I always have a to-do list no matter how small the 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 activity or the job or the task is I must have a to-do list and I don't know people aren't like that I thought it was everybody that used to have a to-do list or everybody that had at least a to-do list per task but some people just remember things like and some people know how know how to do things even without writing them down i literally always have a to-do list i always have to have a to-do list if not ah, i cannot i cannot to function it's not gonna go well <laughs> i won't remember a lot of things anyway so yeah i always have a to-do list even for this video i had a to-do list everything i always have a to-do list and i really enjoy checking things off my to-do list it's just it just makes me happy i don't know it just makes me really happy so yeah those are the 10 weird things about me that you guys probably didn't know if you knew any one of them then you must be very close to me or you follow me on social media or something but um let me know in the description in the comment section three weird things about you let me know how much you know yourself if you know yourself that well and if you know yourself enough tell me three weird things about you in the comment section and any one of these weird things that relate to you as well 
let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video i appreciate you guys and everything you do to support me it means everything to me and yeah thank you so much and i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video I'm so possessive, so I'm not kiss right now.